Ladies and gentlemen, we are shiny fates hunting today. Hopefully I come across something Pokemon related. Right now my GameStop I have these pops right here. Just add them to the pop collection. Don't know how crazy we'll go with the pops, but Pokemon is the goal. Thought this one was pretty cool. It says New York on it. I'm just looking to get Kevin, Daryl, and Dwight. I want to go to a comic store that may have the Shining Fates. I called, they said, come by. We might have some by two o'clock. After calling like five locations and driving all around town. Let's see, let's see. I've never been to this place before. Try it out. Comic book store for the most part. It's called a little bit ago. These are actually what I'll keep going. I think every week, time I get them, they up to three dollars. I uh, love these. He's still the only guy that the guy that gets me that got me these. And I finally get to see it for the first time in person. The shiny Fates pins. W's we're taking, ladies and gentlemen. So we're gonna open up the tin when I get home. Try and save the other tin for another video, just because I am having some difficulty getting this stuff clearly so guys we are back in my room and basically we had a long day looking for stuff we ended up getting the kramer and v 65 dollars for a 10 which i think this is honestly maybe on the lower end like i've seen these things going for like 80 dollars in other places which i might have to go ahead and just say screw it and buy that for that kind of crazy price for the content but regardless in here we have six packs and while i was out of course you guys saw had a couple pickups at GameStop. I want to quickly talk about the pops because I know some of you guys are actually a huge fan of when I talk about my pop collection. So right here we have a Dwight Schrute pop. These are little keychain pops, but I still think that the fact that they made them uh, in general for the office is just collectible. So regardless if they're the full size or not, I have right here the Kevin Malone holding, of course, the crock pot with this famous chili scene. At least once a year, I like to bring in some of my Kevin's famous chili. I'm serious about this stuff. And then we have Daryl Philbin, of course. Awesome show. If you guys have not seen The Office, I don't know what you've been doing. Definitely uh, find a way to watch that. And then we also got right here another pop. This one was New York inspired. It said it's the street art collection deluxe, but it's got Manhattan right on the front of it. And because you guys know we're in the New York state, have to go ahead and represent only available at GameStop, so I thought that was a pretty cool exclusive one. And I'm a, I'm a big fan of Iron Man. I would say he's one of my top three favorite Marvel characters. Well, Masters of the Universe, uh, Skeletor, a huge pop right here, number 998. I don't know the sizing for pop, so I know that like Iron Man was like a medium-sized one. This is a, one of the larger sizes that you can get. With that being said, guys, are you ready to get down into the opening? I know I am, and that's for sure gonna be an exciting one. Six packs of the brand new Shining Fates, and maybe even some Vivid Voltage Redemption, if the tin is some caca, but we obviously don't want that. Uh, something I wanna talk about real quick is the labeling on the tin as well. Not the labeling, the, I guess the plastic around it. It's not covering the entire tin, which I'm honestly not a fan of, because if I wanted to collect these tins, which I do, and display them, which I do, uh, they could potentially have damage on them from being shipped like that. So that's that was a concern for me, honestly, but this tin appears to be pretty good on the outside. So let's check it out. Here is our promo card. So, whoa, that's really dope. I did not even recognize that this was a Sword and Shield promo, number 86. And what's really special about it is you guys can tell it is a shiny promo. I don't think I've ever seen a shiny promo myself. I'm sure they exist, but no, they definitely exist. But uh, this is certainly cool. I thought this was maybe a card from the set. They were just giving like a Cramorant V from the set. But with that being said, we have the Cramorant, the Sword and Shield promo, and our packs. So we have the Shining Fates numbers one, two, three, four, five, and six. Looks like we also have all the artwork here as well. The Corvi Knight, the Charizard, Toxtricity, and Dragapult. So we're gonna do a little pack shuffle here and uh, break it down. Let's get into it, guys. We'll start with the Dragapult pack first. I'm getting my sweat on. This is definitely gonna be uh, a sweaty set to collect. If I don't get a Charizard, I'm gonna be really mad because I've been hunting for the Hidden Fates Charizard for way too long and I still haven't pulled it, but we're gonna continue to persevere on that set. I did pull the Champion's Path Shiny Charizard, but no luck on the rainbow one from that set yet. We pulled it in a live break, actually, and we'll talk a little bit about the live breaks 
later this episode. But here we go, guys. Starting it off, the Fighting Energy, Tropius, Luxio, Jim Trainer, Yanma, Mori Pico, Eevee, Gossy Floor, Yanma, a Shiny Bonaldi, which I actually pulled on live, so that's our first duplicate Shiny, even though I've opened, I think this is my eighth pack now. And here we go, Indie D Hollow. Wow, that might actually be the same exact pack lineup that I got on live. Gonna go ahead and get this in the penny sleeve and the Indie D as well in the penny sleeve. Let's keep it moving. We got a lot of packs left to go. Nice two pulls to start. We got definitely a double banger. Not anything too crazy, but still two back-to-back -back hollow and shiny. All right, what do we got in this one? Please come on. All we want are the shinies. Let's get it. One, two, three, and four to the front. I want to get a complete shiny set. That would be dope. I'm still trying to do that for Hidden Fates. It's uh, certainly expensive for Hidden Fates, and I'd say the prices are just about the same right now for Hidden Fates and this set. So Celebi, non hollow rare, Rusted Sword as our reverse hollow. No shiny for that one. Okay, what pack are we gonna do next? I say we get into the Dragapult. All right, guys, let's see what we got. Here is your code card. Shout out to everybody right now that is subscribed and shout out to everybody that has their post notifications on. Really appreciate everybody that supports the channel with the notifications. That's definitely the number one way you can help me out by watching every video, being a part of the live streams. It's a lot of fun over there, so definitely make sure you check it out. All right, here we go. Nick it, Gossy Floor, and a Team Yeltow Reverse Hollow with another non hollow Celebi as our end card. Well, that Celebi seems like a common to me at this point. Come on, shiny Charizard pack. Let's go. I don't know how people's luck has been looking like either on this set, and I don't know how my luck looks just yet. From, right now, from what I can tell right now, things are looking kind of tough. That's all I could say. Things are looking kind of tough for this set. So here we go. Come on. Dark Energy, Rusted Shield, Floatzel. Oh, and can we also talk about the fact this set has one less card than Champion's Path, number 72. So uh, that's pretty interesting. Decidueye and a Cramorant V regular. That's pretty cool. But this is, uh, this is the slot we wanted to see that in. <laughs> nice, though. We have the promo Cramorant and now the regular Cramorant, which we're going to go ahead, sleeve up, not the Decidueye, the Cramorant. All right, let's continue onwards with the pulls, guys. I'm not even going to cut it. Keep it rolling. Just keep it rolling. We got the Corvi Knight pack next. All right, let's go. Come on. Let's see what we can get here. There's your code card. Please, I hope it's more than one shiny per 10. That would be crazy. All right, guys. Let's get into it. We have the Leaf Energy, Thwacky, Floatzel, Tropius, Snom, Qfant, Weasel, Grookey, Yanma, Kyogre, Amazing Rare. That's pretty cool. I did not know you could get Amazing Rares in this too. But you know what? Oh, I was about to say, is it even textured? Yeah, it's textured. You just have to look at it a little bit. It's a little textured. I'd say not as much as the International. Still very cool to see that though. And oh! Mori Pico V. You know, why does it look like the quality on this, like, print is kind of bad? Like, can you guys see that? I'm gonna put a side by side up. The Mori Pico just looks kind of grayed out, like the name versus the Kyogre. It's nice and bold. Very interesting, but yo, we definitely. I'm, I'm, yo, I'm, I'm seeing some nice pulls here. I, I really wasn't expecting there to be Amazing Rares in this set. I guess because it's tailing on the Shiny Star V set, which has the Amazing Rares. But I kind of didn't realize that it would also just be in the English as well. So that's a cool pull. And then the Mori Pico, I mean, yo, like I said, we will take those double bangers, the back-to-backs. Love to see it. Cool. So, uh, nice. We'll keep it rolling. Don't even cut it, G. Just keep it rolling. We're gonna, we're gonna get to this next pack here. It's the final pack. So hopefully we can get lucky like that again. Maybe this time pull a shiny. That would be something cool. Amazing rare was dope. Can you get two amazing rares per 10? That would be kind of crazy too. All right, let's check it out. There's the code card. And we're gonna do a little one, two, three, and four to the front. And let's begin. Starting off, we have the Lightning Energy, Floatzel, Team Yell Towel, Rodham, Spinarak, 
Snom, Horsey, Roulette, Mori Pico, Trap Pinch. So, wow, one shiny on that pin, and a boss's orders. Well, I gotta say, the good pulls, they were good while they were good, but I'm a little sad that there was only one shiny in that entire box. Um, so we're gonna go ahead right now and do some Vivid Voltage Redemption, but I wanna let you guys know, before we do that, that on my website, BlazingEarthPokemon.com, we have our brand new live break for Burning Shadows Blisters. So as you guys can see, you get three packs, a promo card, and the coin, all for $39.99. This set is rising in price like crazy. The Burning Shadows Charizard, the Rainbow Rare is rising like crazy in price as well. Definitely would want to make sure you guys get in on that opening while you can. I'll leave a link in the description below. We're going to be opening it Sunday, February 28th. So don't miss the live stream. We got literally 100 plus packs of these things. So excited to get it open. Hopefully somebody walks away with a Charizard. That would be sick. But uh, let's see. We got some Vivid Voltage singles just lying around. And I'm really trying to pull this Rainbow Pikachu. So let's see what we can get here, all right? We'll start with the Pika Pika because that's the luck we want. Okay, that's not looking good. That is not looking good to start. But you know what? We could still pull an Amazing Rare. Yeah, yeah, you know what? That's crazy. I guess, I guess I'm realizing that in Vivid Voltage, you can pull an Amazing Rare, as well as Shining Fates. So you can pull Amazing Rares in two English sets, and you can pull it internationally as well. And you can pull it from, I think, this set too, Legendary Harpy in Japanese. I think it's the same thing. So they're kind of going all out on these new Amazing Rares. I really didn't even realize how many different ones there are from these different sets. It's sort of like the Charizard, how they had them from like Base Set, Base Set 2, Legendary Collection, Evolutions. They're sort of reprinting these Amazing Rares. It's kind of interesting. Let's see though, what can we get on our pack? Halo Reverse Hollow and a Fortress. All right. Well, let's see what we can get, guys, in this final one right here. I got my hopes up. Hopefully we can get this rainbow. Let's see. Let's open it up. Here we go. Come on. Good luck. Please. Let's get it. There's the code card. Enjoy it. One, two, three, four to the front. Shout out to everybody that's got their notifications on. And let's begin. We have the Fighting Energy, Coding Energy, Heroes Metal, Stunfisk, Trubbish, Tynamo, Clavopus, Woobat, Halo, Coding Energy, and Vaporeon. Well, guys. That's going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for tuning in. Appreciate you. Make sure you leave a like if you enjoyed. And make sure you subscribe to stay tuned to my future openings. We got Shining Fates, Champions Path. So many crazy sets coming inbound. So make sure you guys stay tuned. And I'll catch you tomorrow. It's your boy Blazer signing out. Stay positive. And